Procedural generation is great when it comes to creating content for your game. While it can take some time to implement, a procedural algorithm can usually output a unique and decent looking result each time we run it. Hello, I'm Peter and welcome to Sunny Valley Studio Tutorials. A procedural town is a challenging topic, but using Lindenmayer system, L system in short, we can achieve a good enough result. In this tutorial, I will do my best to explain what L system is and how it can be implemented in Unity to create a procedural town. Also, a big shout out to Quaternius, who is creating a 3D models that you can use in your games and tutorials because they are licensed CC0. So I recommend you check out his website, the link will be in the description. We will be using some of those models in this tutorial. Before we start, a big thanks to my Patreons who are supporting my work. You guys are awesome. I really enjoy creating those tutorials and I do my best to explain everything clearly, but it really takes me a lot of time to prepare and publish those tutorials. I will be posting part of this tutorial for my Patreons in an early access and in a few days I will be posting them for everyone else. If you can, please support me on Patreon by subscribing to one of the tires. There is a link in the description to my Patreon. You will get access to all the videos right away and for the higher tire I will prioritize your questions on my Discord channel. Which brings me to the topic of a Discord channel that I have prepared for you guys. You can join using a link from the description. To make better videos I really would like to get more feedback from you all and I hope that Discord will allow me to do so. With that out of the way, let's discuss the content of this tutorial in the next video.